Thank you, Co-Chair. Uh, I'm making this statement on behalf of the Farmers Major Group, the Food and Agriculture Cluster of the Angel Major Group and Chef the Children. Uh, first of all, I would like to uh, encourage all member states to maintain the valence and the ambitious character of the Sustainable Development Goals and Targets. Uh, and we, and for, to maintain this balance and the level of ambition, uh, we'd like to make the following uh, suggestions. Uh, in the title of Goal 2 and 12, we strongly urge that all reference to food, nutrition and production uh, in the Declaration or Chapter 1 of the agenda be preceded by using the adjective sustainable to reinforce the message that business as usual is no longer an option. And we also wanted to make a text suggestion that the Im implementation of the sustainable development goals should require the from establishment of appropriate accountability mechanism for all agribusiness uh, corporate bodies uh, and also to end all forms of land grabbing in marginalized communities. Uh, and further to promote food sovereignty. And, and secondly, the description of new agenda in the declaration chapter doesn't address the need to end poverty and hunger, achieve food security, and to eliminate mal malnutrition, despite being prominent in the sustainable development goals themselves. So therefore, we propose to add in the text, para three, the phase, and ensure food and nutrition security so that we read, we intend now between uh, now and to, to 2030 to end poverty and hunger and ensure food and nutrition security once and for all. And in order to reference the symbiotic relationship that exists between humans and nature and particular animals, we suggest that in paragraph 44, we add the words, and all life it sustains and after planet to read the future of humanity or planet and all life it sustains lies in our hand. And similarly, we suggest that in Pera 27, the reference to biodiversity is followed by the qualification, particularly animals. And in the same paragraph, to include, we respect the planetary boundaries and safeguard our ocean and seas. And also to ensure that the poorest and more, most marginalized are not just, as, just seen as people with needs, but rather as development actors with the old rights. We suggest that in Pera 37, we make clear reference to not just all relevant stakeholders, but rather to all relevant right holders and stakeholders. Uh, and I just wanted to highlight, uh, emphasize that to ensure that the post-2015 agenda address the structural factors that undermine sustainable development for all, and with this to include in paragraph 20, 24 that we will work to ensure equitable tenure rights for women, men, marginalized and indigenous peoples in local communities to promote inclusive and human rights based development approach and path. And uh, another is to, man to maintain close linkage between goal two and 11, which suggests that the rural based integrated landscape management approach a key to urban rural linkage, sustainable natural resource management and ecosystem uh, service be included in paragraph 26 of the zero draft. And finally, we would also like to stress that the proposed change to target 6.6 .6 and 15.1 and three uh, and five one ecosystem where we can do level of ambition and not faithfully reflect the CVD's IK targets by extending the original timeline from 2030 and to 2030. And uh, finally, to ensure that there is an open, inclusive and transparent follow up and review process, we would suggest that in bullet 3C in chapter three, a clear reference be made to an enabling environment for the institutionalized and rightful participation of all peoples and their organizations. Thank you, Kosir. Thank you.